Hello everyone. I hope you are having a wonderful day. What I would like to present to you today is my Power BI project, which is based on healthcare reporting and management system. So this is basically to introduce you to what is Power BI, what is a Power BI project, what it looks like, and how it works. So, so my project is all about healthcare reporting and management system. So before starting, let me just explain what a healthcare reporting and management system is. The current situation with healthcare organization is this. They are gathering a lot of data in the sense tons of information flowing to the health, healthcare system across different timelines and in different formats. That is ranging from medical records, departmental data, operational and other financial reporting. So for healthcare organizations operating across multiple loca locations, gathering data insights about various branches like facility performance, revenue summary, departmental information, extra, etc. Uh, it is vital to work towards creating an efficient patient support system. So the majority of the time, the data generated by healthcare workers is silos and stored at different locations. And often this data does not help generate valuable, meaningful, and much anticipated insights. So Microsoft Power BI helps connect such uh, different data sources to offer real-time insights. So this is the motivation or problem statement addressed in this project. And the usefulness of this project is that by implementing healthcare dashboard reporting system, employees in various positions can access the same data and understand how it affects their department. In a complex industry like healthcare, being able to make more informed decisions is a vital part of a successful business strategy. So this is this is the home page of this healthcare reporting system. Uh, so as you can see, the home page contains page navigators to other pages. That is. Uh, the other pages in this uh, in this system is that our hospital, our specialities, our doctors, our staff, patient dashboard, COVID-19. So all these can be accessed from this home page. So home page, it is um, it is basically a welcome page that is used to get the audience attention. So Power BI has various controls like images that can be used to design a page like this. So in fact, that is one of the reasons why the visuals in Power BI look so beautiful. Now, coming to the hospital dashboard. So this dashboard is used to assess the overall performance of the hospital and to submit data to the executive authority in the hierarchy. So patient statistics, admission details, patient satisfaction level, and other hospital-related informations are included in this page. So the staff uses this information to survey uh, and gain results. So uh, the department performance, admission details, and other financial information are also included in this. Uh, so by looking at this page, you can get the vital information like total number of patients that visited the hospital, total number of patients admitted, number of doctors on duty, number of staff on duty, et cetera. See, uh, at a glance itself, you can get gain all these information. Again, bed details, patient statistics, and their flow, patient feedback summary, all these can be summarized in a single page and can be accessed from time to time for analysis. So this is the overall, overall explanation for this our hospital page. Now coming to our speciality, specialities. So uh, this dashboard is used to 
display various specialities and services offered by the hospital. Various departments, its services, bed details, and patient statistics are included in this page. So uh, this page, when it is loaded for the first time, it looks like this. Various departments in the hospital are listed here. Uh, here, we can see the various departments. So by clicking on one of these, we will help you view the details of that particular department. Now, coming to our doctor's page, so the patient perception doc, uh, dashboard looks something like this. So it describes all the details of the doctors working in the hospital. This kind of a dashboard is used when providing information about the situation in a particular department, that is doctors, their uh, departments and specializations, copy timings, phone number, and email ID can be accessed easily from this page. Also, by clicking on a particular department, you will get uh, the doctors who are working in this department, details of the doctors working in this department. And by clicking on a particular doctor, uh, the details will be populated here. So specific details of doctors like phone number, email ID, OPD timings, etc. can be accessed by clicking on clicking on it like this. So for another different record, you will get another information. This is what it is all about. Coming to our staff, our staff perception dashboard. So as the name indicates, it describes all the details of the staff that is working in this hospital. So this kind of page is useful for understanding information about the situation in a particular department, that is staff, their current department, and other details can be accessed from this. So as I pointed out earlier, various departments in the hospitals are listed here. So by clicking on one of this, can help you view the details of that particular department. Also, uh, by using uh, filters, drill through filters and hierarchy, you can further dig deep into the details of a specific department. Coming to patient perception dash dashboard as self-explanatory as the name is, it describes all the details of the patient that was admitted to the hospital or came looking for care. So uh, patients, the departments to which they are admitted, their status, etc., can be accessed easily from this page. Also, by clicking on the department name. The details of patients admitted to a particular de department can be viewed like this. And by and again, specific details of the patient like photo, age, BMI region, COVID infection, etc., can be accessed by clicking on it like this. And Finally, this is the COVID information page of the hospital. So as the COVID-19 pandemic unfolded across the world, one of the greatest barriers we encountered was the absence of a, of a credible and consistent da data tracking system. So tracking daily hospitalization data will therefore help in quantifying the current impact on local hospital system, modeling and forecasting future utilization needs, and tracking the rate of change in the disease severity. So this page gives various COVID information statistics like confirmed cases, uh, illness, 
hospital confirmed cases, uh, recovery and deaths, mortality, recovery rates, etc. at a glance. So a region-wise statistics is also displayed using a map in this page. This is what it is all about. So to summarize, a healthcare that um, we can say that healthcare dashboards are analytical software tools which empower healthcare professionals to make real-time data-driven decisions by combining information from multiple sources into one single view. Uh, so by seeing this, I hope you got an idea of what a Corbair project looks like and how it works. Thank you.